Hello, my name is Rosie and I'd like to welcome you back to my front room once again for virtual rhyme time from North Somerset Library Service. If you're very good at spotting things, you might have noticed that Henry and I are wearing hats today. The thing is, we've all been having our haircuts at home by each other and some of them have gone better than others. Henry here has added number four all over and he's looking, I think you'll agree, as smart as usual. Simon, who's behind the camera, cut my hair. He's cut it and he's coloured it. I'll show you. I'll show you. There we go. I hope it's tidy. He's done a very good job. It's straight and uh, he's made it a little bit darker, which I think is rather nice. Uh, and the other thing about it is it's not grey anymore. Don't tell anyone. Anyway, I'm pleased. But poor old Simon, behind the camera, I've cut his hair and, well, I, I can't lie, I've not done a very good job. He had lovely hair and now he's just got hair and not much of that either. So he won't be coming out from behind that camera for some time, if ever, will you Simon? No. Mm, sorry about that. Anyway, luckily for us, we've got this big basket of hats, I hope you can see there. And we'll be trying all of those on later and doing some rhymes to go with these hats and those hats. Um, but first we will start with our welcome song and Henry would really love it if you wave hello to him. He's going to wave hello to you. Are you ready? One, two, three. Hello everyone, how are you today? Very well, thank you, we're okay. We've just begun. We're going to have some fun. It's music, rhythm and rhyme. Same again. Hello everyone, how are you today? Very well, thank you, we're okay. We've just begun. We're going to have some fun. It's music, rhythm and rhyme. Very good. Okay, so Henry's hat. What sort of hat is this? Do you know who might wear a hat like this? Very tall and white, flopping over his eyes a little bit. It's a chef's hat, that's right, or a baker's hat. And Henry has been doing a lot of baking since we've been staying at home. You might be able to tell he's a little bit rounder than he used to be. And so am I. Um, so, a baking song. What about Pat a Cake, Pat a Cake, Baker's Man? That's a nice one. I'll pop him there because we're going to do some pat a caking like this. Clapping, it's a clapping rhyme. And I have tried to do it with Henry. We had a practice but I accidentally pushed him off the table and he didn't like it. He said he was fed up with it and he wasn't doing it anymore. So I'm going to pretend I'm doing pat a cake with you instead and I'll go one hand, two hands, yes, one hand, one hand, two hands and clap in between each one, okay? You could do it with your grown-ups or you could do it with your cuddlies if they're not as strict as Henry, but I'll try and do it, pretend I'm doing it with you. Are you ready? One, two, three. Pat a cake, pat a cake, baker's man. Bake me a cake as fast as you can. Pat it and prick it and mark it with B and put it in the oven for baby and me. Did you do it? Very good. Um, now I think, oh I know, let's do three currant buns in a baker's shop. So we'll have three buns and the first bun, along will come Henry with a penny one day buy a currant bun and take it away. Then the second bun, I'll buy. So along came Rosie with a penny one day, bought a currant bun and took it away. And the last bun, which I have to say is the best looking bun, is for you. So um, we'll say along came and then I'll pause and you shout out your name and then you can buy the bun and you can enjoy the bun. Ready? One, two, three. Three currant buns in a baker's shop Round and fat with a cherry on the top Along came Henry with a penny one day Bought a currant bun and took it away Now it's my bun Two currant buns in a baker's shop Round and fat with a cherry on the top Along came Rosie with a penny one day Bought a currant bun and took it away It's your turn One currant bun in a baker's shop Round and fat with a cherry on the top, along came. With a penny one day, bought a currant bun and took it away. Oh, lovely. I'm showing a currant bun now. Um, what should we do next, Henry? 
Oh, that's a good choice. Half a pound of tuppenny rice. Half a pound of treacle. Your grown-ups will know this. It's very old, so not that they're very old. Just I am. Half a pound of tuppenny rice. Half a pound of treacle. Um, that's the way the money goes. Pop goes the weasel. You can clap. Pop goes the weasel if you want to. And then there's lots of second verses. I think I'll sing up and down the city road. The monkey chased the weasel. The monkey stopped to pull up his sock. And then we can go, pop goes the weasel again. Are you ready? One, two, three. Half a pound of tuppenny rice, half a pound of treacle. That's the way the money goes, pop goes the weasel. Up and down the city road, the monkey chased the weasel. The monkey stopped to pull up his sock, pop goes the weasel. It's completely bonkers that song, isn't it? Lots of the rhymes don't make much sense. Um, so is that all the foodie ones we could do for Henry's Baker's hat? I think it probably is. So what about my hat? My hat, what do you think? Who would wear a hat like this? Please be polite. All my friends laugh at me in this hat. They think it's a silly hat, but I like it. It's a rain hat with a special name. It's called a sou'wester. It's a funny name, isn't it? A sou'wester, like a southwesterly wind. And it keeps the rain off me at the front and on the back of my neck, so it's very good. So, rainy songs. What about Incy Wincy Spider? That's a good rainy song. Get your incy wincy fingers ready like that, like that. Are you ready? He's going to climb up that spout. One, two, three. Incy wincy spider climbed up the spout. Down came the rain and washed the spider out. Out came the sunshine and dried up all the rain. And incy wincy spider climbed up the spout again. Very good. Now we can't do a spidery one without doing cross cross line line actually. I'll, Henry, I'll take your hat off because it's going to fall off otherwise I think. Turn him round and we're going to do cross cross line line. So you could do this on your cuddly's back or maybe your grown ups can do it on your back with their finger and watch out. You know what happens at the end of this one don't you? Get a tickle. Ready? One, two, three. Cross, cross, line, line, spiders crawling up your spine. Cool breeze, little bow, tight squeeze, and now wait for it, you've got the shivers. Very good, very good. You sit there again, Henry. Um, now the other thing about this sort of hat is fishermen might wear this sort of hat out on their boats in the gales and the wind. So let's do a fishing song. What about one, two, three, four, five? I caught a fish alive. Now then. Oh, hidden my fish. Let's have a look. Here we are. Here we are. Finger puppet fish. Put that on my finger. Have a look. Is that a fish? Is it? No, that's a giraffe. Look, a long neck and a spotty face and neck. That's a giraffe. That's not right. Here we are. Here's a fish. Nice green fish. There we go. Is that a fish? Dear oh me, teasing you aren't I? Here we go, what about that? Can you see from the side, big fin, a long tail, lots of teeth, that's a shark. Okay, so he's our fish and we'll go and catch one, two, three, four, five, once I caught a fish alive. Are you ready? One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. Once I caught a fish alive. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Then I let him go again. Why did you let him go? Because he bit my finger so. Which finger did he bite? This little finger on the right. Ooh, he's only pretending. Not really biting me, are you? Let's pop him down. Um, so, a fisherman is a sort of sailor, isn't he? A sailor. So let's do... Um, a sailor went to CCC to see what he could see, see, see. For that we go CCC. Oh, hey, guys. Let me take it off. Ooh, can't get it off. I've got, got it tied onto the back of my head. Put that one in there. Oh, heck. How's that? Do I look tidy again? Um, we're going to go. A sailor went to CCC to see what he could see, see, see. But all that he can see, see, see is the bottom of the deep blue. CCC. Okay, let's have a go at that. 
A sailor went to see, 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 to see what he could see, see, see. But all that he could see, 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 was the bottom of the deep blue sea, see, see. Now that's okay. We're next going to do a sailor went to chop, chop, chop. Ready? Same, but with chop, chop, chop. A sailor went to chop, chop, chop to see what he could chop, chop, chop. But all that he could chop, chop, chop was the bottom of the deep blue chop, chop, chop. Now we're going to do knee, knee, knee. Okay. A sailor went to knee, knee, knee to see what he could knee, knee, knee. But all that he could knee, knee, knee was the bottom of the deep blue knee, knee, knee. And now we're going to put all those together. So we're going to say C, chop, knee. And just to make it more complicated, we're going to do it as quickly as we can. Are you ready? I'll probably get in a muddle, but I'll have a go. Are you ready? One, two, three. A sailor went to see chop knee to see what he could see chop knee, but all that he could see chop knee was the bottom of the deep blue sea chop knee. Oh, don't know why I thought that was a good idea. I don't think it was actually. Um, another watery one. This is a bathtub, but it could be the sea because turtles don't really live in the bathtub, do they? Can you see him? I had a little turtle we're going to do now. His name was Tiny Tim. I put him in the bathtub to see if he could swim. He's going to drink up all the water. He's going to eat up all the soap. And then he's going to be sick in bed, poor thing, with a bubble in his throat. And this is the good bit. We'll have a bubble, 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 and then the bubble will pop. Are you ready? One, two, three. I had a little turtle, his name was Tiny Tim. I put him in the bathtub to see if he could swim. He drank up all the water, he ate up all the soap, and now he's sick in bed with a bubble in his throat. Ready? Bubble, 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 one more, bubble, pop! Very good, well done. Let's pop tiny turtle there. Um, okay, so a different hat now. Let's see. What about this hat? Do you know who would wear a hat like this? My granddaughter's farmer and he used to wear a hat like this. So I think, nice peek, we'll sing some farming songs now. What about Old MacDonald? He had a farm, didn't he? Um, so the animals, let's see, what animals shall we have? Shall we have a cow? What sound does a cow make? Can you make a cow sound? Ooh, okay, I'm going to ask Simon behind the camera where he's hiding. What sound does a cow make, Simon? Moo. Moo, very good, very good. And what else shall we have on our farm? Let's have a pig. Would you like to make a pig sound for me, children? Okay, let's see what, can compare it with Simon. Simon, would you like to make a pig sound? Oink, oink. Very good, very good. And last one, let's have a sheep. I think we'll have a sheep. So, can you make a sheep sound? And you, Simon? Ah. Very, very good. See, he has been practising. Okay, so let's do Old MacDonald Had a Farm. Don't forget, it's cow, pig, sheep. I say that, I'll probably forget. Okay, ready? One, two, three. Old MacDonald had a farm. E-I-E-I-O. And on that farm he had a cow, E-I-E-I-O, with a moo moo here and a moo moo there, here a moo, there a moo, everywhere a moo moo, old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O, and on that farm he had a pig, E-I-E-I-O, with an oink oink here and an oink oink there, here an oink, there an oink, everywhere an oink oink, old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O, last one, let's have a sheep, and on that farm he had a sheep, E-I-E-I-O, with a bar bar here and a bar bar there, here a bar, there a bar, everywhere a bar bar, old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O, very good. Um, so our last animal there was a sheep. Why don't we do Bob our black sheep? That's a nice one. And don't forget, we'll say thank you as well at the end. Now, okay, how's that go? I know. One, two, three. Bob our black sheep. Have you any wool? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Three bags full. 
One for the master and one for the dame And one for the little boy who lives down the lane Thank you said the master, thank you said the dame And thank you said the little boy who lives down the lane Very good, that's nice and polite isn't it? Okay, uh, another hat I think Take that one off And I'm going to put this one on Ooh, ooh that's snug One for Henry as well He's got a nice yellow one. Oh, 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 he's disappeared. Oh, poor Henry, that's not right. Let's prop him up there. There we go. So who might wear a hat like these? I think a builder, probably, or someone on a building site, construction. So let's do a building song. Um, we'll do Henry hammers with one hammer, with your hand like that. Then two hammers, two hands. Then three hammers, that's a foot. Then four hammers, that's both your hands and your feet. And then five hammers, that's your head, your hands and your feet. Do you think you can do that? Not sure I can actually, but we'll see. Ready? One, two, three. Henry hammers with one hammer, one hammer, one hammer. Henry hammers with one hammer all day long. Henry hammers with two hammers, two hammers, two hammers. Henry hammers with two hammers all day long. Now your foot. Henry hammers with three hammers, three hammers, three hammers. Henry hammers with three hammers all day long. Two feet. Henry hammers with four hammers, four hammers, four hammers. Henry hammers with four hammers all day long. Now your head as well. Henry hammers with five hammers, five hammers, five hammers. Henry hammers with five hammers all day long. <sighs> Dear oh me, I'm tired out of you, Henry. He says he is. He says he's had enough work and he wants to play now. So we're going to do Teddy plays on the swing. So to take him into the slides and the swing, I think we'd better take that hat off you. I'm going to keep mine on. It's quite snug. Right, he's going to play on the swing. He's going to play on the slide. You can do it with your cuddlies, but I think you're probably too heavy to do that with your mum and dad's knee. And then, but this is the good bit. This is the bit you can join in. We will tick tock forwards and back, round and round we go. Okay, ready? One, two, three. Teddy plays on the swing. Teddy plays on the slide. Teddy plays on the swing. And Teddy plays on the slide. Get ready. And he goes tick tock. Forwards and back, round and round he goes. Tick tock, forwards and back, round and round he goes. And he goes tick tock, forwards and back, round and round he goes. Tick tock, forwards and back, round and round he goes. Very good. Okay, so we'll. It's nearly time to finish. So we'll do um, a bit of a goodbye song, not our actual one, but we'll do the bread and butter marmalade and jam song clapping like that and we will say let's say goodbye as let's try slowly so we will say let's say goodbye as slowly as we can goodbye like that okay ready one two three bread and butter marmalade and jam let's say goodbye as slowly as we can good Very good. Shall we do it as squeakily as we can? That's what I'm quite good at squeaking. Ready? Bread and butter, marmalade and jam. Let's say goodbye as squeakily as we can. Goodbye! There you go. Very high pitched. Um, right, well, it's probably time to finish now, so we'll do our actual goodbye rhyme now. Now, don't forget, we're going to reach down and touch our toes, then our knees, then our chest but we're not going to touch our noses, okay? Then we will tickle our tummy, hold our hands high, and then wave bye-bye. Ready? One, two, three. Everybody touch your toes. Everybody touch your knees. Everybody touch your chest. Don't touch your nose. Tickle your tummy, hold your hands high. Everybody wave bye-bye, bye-bye. Thank you for joining Henry and I. Don't forget to keep rhyming. I know I keep saying it, but it's really important. Keep rhyming, keep sharing books together, and hope to see you in the library again soon. Keep yourself away. Well, bye-bye now. Bye-bye.